Foxes. Today's a fox day, everyone. Yay! It's the year of the fox, the day of the fox. It's not really the year of the fox. I want you to give uh, my editor, George, a round of applause. George, can you edit it so like a huge audience is giving you a, a, an applause? He did the huge task of compiling a massive list of foxes together that I will be ranking today on my trusty wall because I don't feel like doing it in editing software. That's too hard. This is clearly the easier way. So, uh, here you guys go. I made a tier list on my wall. Okay, so he's having a list of all these different foxes. I cut every single one of them out. We have a list of 48 foxes. Let's go. Fox ranking video. I'm gonna take the pause off because it was really difficult last time. Also, I briefly looked through the list of foxes that he sent me and uh, a lot of these foxes I don't know. So I have an IDK category here. Sorry, George. I don't know all these foxes. Disappointed! Also, if, if there are foxes that you think that are not, that did not make it on the list, just blame my editor, George, okay? It's not my fault. First fox is, uh, who is this? This is Tyrox from Switzerland. That was a good first fox. Clearly he's gonna go on the IDK category. I'm just kidding. Yeah. S category, clearly. Tyrox is my boyfriend. I don't know if you know him, but um, he's cute. And he makes a lot of really cute sounds. Ah. He's actually a tiger mixed with a fox. So I don't know if that qualifies him as a fox, but uh, next fox is Kurama by Naruto. So I don't watch a lot of Naruto. I have seen a lot of art of this fox. And why is he always so big? He a big boy. Maybe this box will be the reason why I'm gonna watch Naruto. Actually, you know, let's put him in the B category. I don't know this box, but I've seen a lot of really good art of him. So George, I swear if you if you put in the E61 logo again, again, George. But yeah, I mean, it is the source of where I find all my foxes. Oh my God. Jaden from the Z world. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna put this box in uh, A tier. It's a nice box, a lot of good art. All I can think of is uh, when George was editing the wolf from Puss in Boots and he was like editing all of the images of the wolf and the song why can't we be friends i like that it's a good touch because there's so much good art of jaden jaden why can't we be friends you know swifty read it rufus by mau mau heroes of pure heart don't know am i disappointing you george because i don't know a lot of these foxes son you disappoint me Fox of the World by Old Speckled Hen. I recognize that art, but I don't think I know him. I don't know this fox, but he looks really cute. I'll put him in the D category. I was gonna make a D joke, but I don't want to. Haha, <laughs> it was a sex joke. Just a fox from Beastars, clearly. I'm gonna put him in a pretty high category. I think I lost my furry card though, because guys, I have, to, I have a confession to make. <sighs> I haven't seen Beastars season two yet. I haven't seen Beastars season two yet. Shame! Shame on you! Shame on you! Is there a fox in season one? You're in a bit of a tough spot yourself. I'm gonna put this fox at like C category because he cute. He cute. The Cunning Trickster from Balto 2. Um, yeah, I haven't seen Balto 2 because there shouldn't be a Balto 2. He's got a point. Balto is based off of a true story. What is Balto 2? I haven't seen Balto 2 because I refuse to, okay? I've seen Balto 1 and I'm like, it's based off of history, all right? You see that storm on the horizon? Only one man and one dog can make that run. But he does look very cunning. I'll put him in the D category. Wait, if I like someone, why'd I put him in the D category? I don't know my reasoning. Don't antagonize me. Oh, Vixie by the Fox and the Hound. I've seen the Fox and the Hound when I was a child. A child. Yeah, it was a very long time ago because I'm ancient. 35, if you're asking. I'm kidding. I'm 45. Okay. Vixie's kind of cute, but I don't know them very well. So D. Tails by Sonic. Honestly, I thought Tails was actually <laughs> kind of annoying. So Tails, you're going in the F category. I'm sorry, I probably broke a couple of people's dreams. Todd by the Fox and the Hound. Oh, look at this art. Look at this art. Oh, that's so cute. Todd, you are cute. I'm gonna put you in the C category. Yes. Phoenix by Fortnite. <sighs> Okay, so I don't play Fortnite, but Phoenix is nice. Nice. I do like Phoenix. Clearly, clearly Phoenix is going up here in the A category. Is there any sticky tape left? Okay. <laughs> I keep... Oh God. Oh no, I just caught the B too. Oh, stand by. Oh my God. <laughs> My lunch is literally over in five minutes. It's fine. It's fine. Just don't tell my boss. Gets a raise by running YouTube videos. Swiper by Dora the Explorer. Swiper, you're annoying. I'm sorry. You're not even cute. F category. Maiden Maiden. Oh, okay. This next one. <laughs> Wait a second. What is this picture? George, why did you pick this picture? Oh no. 
Why, why are you gonna make her look so hot? I mean, a lot of us have opinions about Maid Maiden, but um, she's definitely up there for me. Who should compete with Tyrox? I feel like Tyrox needs his own category, okay? He needs like SS tier. I can't put anyone on the same tier as Tyrox, except Maid Maiden. All right, Maid Maiden, you're going right, right there. Underneath him, it's fine. It's fine, if it's underneath. James McCloud by Star Fox. I actually haven't played a lot of the Star Fox games. I actually don't know who James McCloud is. Sorry for letting you down, George. Son, you disappoint me. Oh my God. The fox from NSFW famous video. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, A tier. Crystal from Star Fox. Look at this picture. George, you picked the sauciest pictures for these characters. George, are you trying to get me thirsty? And that's to say thank you. Well, uh, okay. She's nice, but not as nice as Maid Maiden. I don't know. Uh, A. She's A. Cajun by Courage the Cowardly Dog. Courage the Cowardly Dog is like, honestly, a very like terrifying TV show to watch as a kid that really make you question life. I did not like that TV show. I'm sorry, Cajun. You're going in the F category. Panico from Agritsuko. Uh, you're also gonna hate me for this. You can revoke my furry card like three times over because I haven't seen Agritsuko either. I feel like I just don't watch a lot of movies or TV shows. It's a problem. If I'm trying to stay relevant in the fandom. Dunno. Renamon from Digimon 3 and look at the photo that we have. Round of applause for George. Thank you, George, for picking the for picking that photo. Renamon, ooh, ooh. Okay, Renamon. Uh between A or S tier. A tier. <laughs> Gideon Gray from Zootopia. It took me a long time to come around to Gideon Gray, just because of like he's a bully, and I know that he's gone through like a lot of character development. Even though he came around as, a, as an adult, I'm just like, no. And I know there's a lot of like saucy art of him, but uh, it just doesn't do it for me. I'm sorry. You go on the D tier, Gideon. Fox McCloud from Star Fox. He's all right. D tier. I know a lot of people like Fox McCloud, but um, he's a cute guy. I don't get the hype. Finnick from Zootopia. Finnick is the tiny Fennec Fox from Zootopia who has like a really low voice. You kiss me tomorrow. I bite your face off. Not really my type. Round D tier. Honest John from Pinocchio. Ooh, hello. What is that? This art though. I have not seen Pinocchio, but he looks really cute. So I'll put him at a D. No way. If I don't know him, I'm gonna put him in the IDK territory. Mr. Fox from Fantastic Mr. Fox. This guy is very cunning. I would love to meet him in real life. Mr. Fox from Fantastic Mr. Fox, if you're watching, we should hang out sometime. You're really cunning. You know, I would probably take you out a date. A tier. Nick Wilde from Zootopia. There's not really much explaining that I need to do here. He's a cunning guy. He has a nice voice. He's cute. I feel like I'm a typical furry for doing this, but... Uh, do it. Uh, uh, do it! Okay, Nick Wilde, yeah. He's S tier. I'm sorry. So typical of me. I'm sorry. Foxy from Five Nights at Freddy's. Let's look at the art. That is some nice art. I mean, the image that I have in my brain, Foxy from Five Nights at Freddy's, but like the 3D model of Foxy from Five Nights at Freddy's, he's kind of ugly. And they intentionally made him ugly. And I've seen a lot of good fan art of him, but he's still USB material. Nine Tails from Pokemon. Basically a feral, right? I mean, he cute, but I'll put him on an F. Robin Hood from Robin Hood. Oh Lord. I don't know if I have much to say about Robin Hood. It was one of the movies that I didn't watch when I was a kid and I didn't get around to watching it until just recently. Yeah, he's a handsome fellow. And I like the part where he like, he dressed up as a girl to uh, steal the rubies from that snake king. That was a cute scene, I like that. He's a good trickster. I just don't know, he's a- uh... Robin Hood B. Which is funny, because I put Maid Maiden at the S category, but that's also because George put like a really sexy image of Maid Maiden, okay? That's my defense. Mrs. Fox from Fantastic Mr. Fox. C category. Bam. I got nothing windy to say. Greg from Night in the Woods. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Night in the Woods? Is that a comic strip? It's a comic strip, isn't it? But I like this art of Greg. But I don't know. So I'm going to put him in the IDK. You were the chosen one. Okay, we are nearing the end of the list, and I know what a lot of you have been asking yourselves. Where is Diane Foxington from the back? Diane Foxington, everyone. Yeah, there are a lot of art that I could have used um, that George included, but a lot of them were just, they were so spicy that I, I went with this one, okay? Diane Foxington, she is a 10 in my book. Yeah, I don't know, she's just very cunning and she perfectly portrays what a sly fox is. I'll put her at the S category. Absolutely, she's an S in my book. Ooh, I guess the real question is, 
Diane or the wolf. I think that's why I'm bi. I guess I can't decide between the two. I'll take both. Both. Why not both? And last but not least, everyone, we have, what is this? We have the old, the sexiest fox of them all. What does the fox say? Yelvis. Yelvis? Did I say it right? Absolutely, like above all else, other than Tyrox, he goes S tier. You know, if I had to choose between him or Diane Foxington or Maid 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 Maiden, did I say Maid Maiden the whole time? Maid Maiden. Maid Maiden. Maid Maiden. You're Maid Maiden. I'm Maid Maiden. If I had to choose between him or Maid Marion, then I would clearly choose him or Nick Wilde. Woo! We made it. These are all the foxes in the IDK category. I'm sorry. Don't hate me. Then we have the foxes that I hate. Absolutely, positively hate. F category. I'm sorry. Tails comes across as like being too submissive. In the D category, we have uh, all these guys. Actually, I feel like Vixie from the Fox and the Hound could go a little bit higher, but I'm sorry. A category, this is where it starts getting spicy, okay? We got Mr. Fox from Fantastic Mr. Fox. Very handsome fella. We got Renabon. What is that beautiful picture that you're using? We got Crystal, Crystal from Star Fox. Yes, absolutely. The Fox from NSFW, famous video. Don't ask for sauce on that, just don't. Read the comments below. <laughs> I'm sure someone will explain it. Jaden from the Z World, uh, artist named Zausch. And then we have Fenix from Fortnite, yep. And last but not least, we have the S category. We have absolutely, what does the fox say? Yell this, what a sexy individual. Wish I could be like him when I grow up. We have Diane Foxington, let me just see the art of her. Very nice art. Diane Foxington, I would go to war for you. Nick Wilde, uh, yeah, I'm a typical furry, I'm sorry. Maid Maiden, just look at that picture. <laughs> Come on, Maid Maiden, right? Would you go straight for Maid Maiden? I would. No, I wouldn't. And last but not least, we have Tyrax in the S tier. He should be in the, like the SS tier because he's like the best fox of them all. But yeah, it was fun. There's a lot of foxes, but I hope I got a significant amount of them. I know I, we probably missed a couple. If there are any foxes that you uh, thought needed to be in the list, comment below and maybe I'll rank it on the spot. I do weekly videos. 9 a.m. every Friday is what I'm aiming for. That's what I've been doing for the past several months. If you like the video, make sure to leave a little thumbs up. And if you want to see more stuff that I do in the future, make sure to hit subscribe. Thank you guys for tuning in and I'll see you guys next week. Bye bye. So if you want to see more of us, so if, I am sweating, dude. Okay. Today's a fox day. Everyone, can we, can, where's the remote? I mean the microphone. Gosh dang it. I am all over the place. Okay, hold on. Why am I so out of breath? It's just like, it's a recent thing, man. It's a recent thing that I'm always out of breath. Come on, camera. Pause, 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 and focus.